download Among Us today by simply going into the App Store, searching for it and pressing install. It is free to install, but it does have in-app purchases in it, such as the pets and some other things. So yeah. Hey everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my channel today. I'm going to be showing you guys Among Us for beginners. So most of you are probably not beginners and you might just be wondering, what is this video about and what happens in it so basically i'm going to be showing you the different parts of among us what you can do on it and also some just to maybe share some facts about it so i'm gonna like read the stuff about it and stuff because you know for all we know there might be someone who might not be able to read as good and they won't be able to read most of the words on it so on this bottom thing with the siren it's announcements it says it was it was made on the 11th of the f just that day 11 slash or 1 slash 2020 and it says hey everyone just a few things among us 2020 of the 10th 22 released recently check here for more details still working on the servers we will have an update soon sorry about the disconnect and incorrect hack bands there'll be another app update next week to fix ios record att record attempts temps task and some other bugs we just relaunched our merch store please check it out thanks for playing so if you click on the purple bit it does have a merch store which we don't want to look at yet and you can click here for more details let's just get rid of this and it will tell you more about it i'm not gonna I'm not going to read through all of it because it's quite a lot. But you guys can do that. And then next to it is the settings. You can click on general data. It says what language you can have. So you can have English, Sp Spanish, Portuguese, Korean or Russian. And you have personalised ads. And you have general where you can choose whether you want the joystick or you want a touch to move. You can control the sound on it. It's like that. I have mine off and sensor chart. You can decide whether you want the chat on or off. Next one, if you click on the inner sloth, it says artists Amy L and Marcus B, programmer, programmer Forrest W. They obviously have. Oh. How about that? They have Discord, Twitter, and Facebook. Translators are all here. So yeah. And then what you want to do is you want to click on this graph and it tells you about the statistics and stuff about you I think I think and then obviously on this it tells you about purchases that you've got so you can buy different of these pets on Among Us whoa where did that baby thing so like you can have these two little imposters that follow you and you can also remove ads but you need to pay for that so if you click on local you you can come up with your own name so i just put mine as i don't know how i but i'm going to change it back to my youtube channel name and you can either you can create a game but we don't want to do that just yet <laughs> and then if you click on how to play it will tell you how to play so among us is a game of teamwork and betrayal please are either crewmates or an imposter Play with 4 to 10 plays online or via local Wi Fi. Controls you have a joystick or you can touch. When hosting a game, you have the control over how the game plays. Firstly, determine who you want to play with. If you want to play with friends online, set to private and share the room code. If you want to play with others from around the world, set to public. Want to play with more tasks? How about faster walk speed, more imposters? As host, you can change these settings. Be sure to confirm the changes with your fellow players. If someone is being rude and or spamming, hosts can temporarily kick players as a warning or ban players from the specific online room. Players have access to a personal map to help them navigate the ship. Objective, fill group tasks bar or discover the imposter. Complete Complete tasks to fill gorge. React to imposter's sabotage. Call emergency meeting when imposter found. Report dead bodies. Check admin map and security for suspicious activity. Blend in with... Oh, that was the crewmate tasks, like, as a crew. 
The imposter is kill off the crew. Blend in with the crew, sneak through events, pretend to run tasks, sabotage the ship and confuse the crew, close the doors and trap victims, kill off the crew between cooldowns. While playing in person, no talking is allowed to keep the game fair between the crew and the imposter. If a player is killed by the imposter, they cannot talk until the game ends. Ghosts still run their assigned tasks, working towards a possible crewmate's win. That was, like, you know, discuss. When someone reports a dead body or calls an emergency meeting, the crew gathers to discuss what they know about the imposter. Players can now talk openly about who they think the imposter is and what information they have. When playing in person, ghosts cannot talk as they already know who the imposter is. Imposters will try to prove their innocence or accuse another crew member. After discussion, vote for who you think is the imposter. Whoever gets majority votes will be ejected from the ship, so vote wisely. If you don't have enough information and have decided as a crew, you can also skip voting to avoid ejecting someone innocent and gather more information. Practice in free play mode. Set your own tasks as a crew member or practice your imposter killing strategies. So that's about that. So free play, you can click here and you can decide what maps you want. So I don't know what they are because they've been cut off. So I'm going to show you guys all the maps on free play. So what you can do is you can run around and you can practice with tasks. So you can do this, you can do your tasks. I'm not going to go through every single task. I'm just going to show you around the place. So this is the map here and obviously your settings so this is the map and as you can see as you move around you can see a little white character or whatever color skins you have on the game oh god hello hello and um that will like show you where you can go and you can like walk while you are like looking at the map which is good but if you know the place from top to bottom, then you can obviously go without the map. To leave the game, you can click on the settings and you can press leave game. Um, let's go on to the next map. This is another map I have not used this one before. And you can also look around the same thing with the map. To sabotage vent, you can press vent. To get out and you can press vent to get back in and you can also sabotage i don't know what sabotage actually means oh so like you can self replace <laughs> right we're gonna try and find a dummy just let me do my task oh you just spam random thing okay so there to be to kill you can go up to someone and you click kill and then you find the body then you click report and then you can discuss so you can put i saw red vent and you can lie about who you think it was so most people voted dummy one and dummy six and you press proceed and then the person who was it will get dropped from a hot air balloon really i don't know <laughs> and then the last map is another thing and obviously you have the emergency meeting and you can press that to throw an emergency meeting and you can say who you think it was so i'm gonna vote green okay so nobody like nobody really got voted out again and basically they would just drop down into this lava if they were the imposter or they got caught okay so local i showed you that online what you can do is you can host a game and you can change the settings between four players that can play five six seven eight nine ten and you can also change your map and choose how many imposters that you want and then you press confirm obviously you can enter record to join a game so let's just put a random letters on so like basically let's join a public game so if you click on find game you can go down to any game at all and it will have a code down at the bottom we're not going to stay on this game i'm not staying on the game 
but this is the customize you can change your settings if you are the host of the game and you can customize your avatar like that okay so yeah that's how you play among us and you can obviously do different matches you can change your country or oh, i am not asia i'm europe and obviously there's a question mark so how does this work hosting a game button gives you game gives you a game code near the start button share the game code with friends to create a private room or tap private to make the room public to make the room public for find game the host can ban or kick players whenever chat is available still having problems let us know on our discord i don't know what their discord is because i don't have discord so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video hope this helps if you're new to among us and i will see you all in the next video